really excited to be a part of Art in Transit for the first time. Um, my zine, Who is Bangalore, has been published as part of the Bangalore San Francisco Comic Anthology. I'm really kicked about it. A little bit about <laughs> myself. Um, I'm an artist. Um, I just released um, a book of mine called Ellie as God um, this month. And uh, my blog, sapnodubey.com, was voted as the best arts and theatre blog in India at the Indian Blogger Awards in December 2017. So I'm really proud of that. <laughs> and I'm also one of the top 100 women entrepreneurs uh, in India in 2017, 2018, uh, chosen by IIMB from across India. Um, and my startup is called Laboratory of Creativity. And I plan to uh, retail uh, DIY creativity kits for children. So look out for LOC. Um, these are some of the exhibitions that I've been part of. Um, those are my loves and interests. I love painting. I actually have uh, discovered my love for installation art. So I want to share with you some of the works that I've done in the past three months um, with installations. Some of the installations that were commissioned by VR Bengaluru. It's one of the biggest malls in Bangalore. Um, this one on the top left uh, was for Mother's Day. So, just a sample. Some more installations, all done in the past three months. My current work, Ellie as God, uh, is the elephant as God and not Ganesha as the elephant. I created the series of 21 paintings to create awareness about elephants in captivity and to raise awareness about elephants that are used in processions and temples. And no Hindu scripture, Islamic or Christian scriptures um, tell us that elephants are required in temples. It's cruelty. Um, so it's to raise awareness about that. So please do go and visit the exhibition. It's on at the Art Corridor, Taj Western, till October 31st. Uh, please do go and check it out. And send me a photo if you can. That's my email there, sapna.dube at icloud.com. This is my idea for an installation at the Kabul Metro. It's called Love Letters. I'm sure all of you have seen graffiti in bathrooms, in public places, where a person draws a heart and then says S loves R, R loves M, etc., etc. We're looking up uh, at expressing, I don't know about you and me, but there's a whole lot of people out there who want to express their love in a public place. So this gives a platform to those people and to a whole lot of others of our generation living in the digital age and the age of Tinder where the love letter, the concept of a love letter is nearly dead. And even if we do write a love letter, it's a short note on a WhatsApp or an email. And the beauty of a love letter is not there at all. So I'm trying to give an opportunity to people to write anonymous love letters to the people they love. So a person can come there, write a letter, put it in one of the envelopes, and read an envelope that's already filled with somebody else's letter. And, you know, it's just an experience sharing love and of, of, a, of a lost, um, of a lost love, or somebody of a secret love, or a secret, whatever you call it. So this is my idea. Um, if you have any questions, please.